Uh, we have here a Quantum Edge 3, practically brand new. This chair has three miles, practically brand spanking new. It has a larger seat, so if you're looking for a Quantum Edge 3, you need a larger seat. This one has a pretty large seat. So three miles, fully loaded. It has the 12 inch seat lift, the electric tilt, the electric recline, and the electric feet. Four functions, okay? So let's go ahead and raise the seat. You can do the, all the, the seat function through the joystick or through the switch box. I like to use the switch box, it's quicker for me. On this switch box, the seat lift is the third button in. So if I hold that button down, the seat will start going up. So you're gonna start roughly at 22 inches when you're down. By the time the seat is all the way up, it'll be at 34 inches. Now, the nice thing about this chair, once the seat is elevated to 34 inches, all the way up to 34 inches, this chair will still drive. This chair will still drive at, you gotta keep your finger on the button because you, as soon as you let go, it stops going up. Um, it'll drive at three, four miles an hour. So I can't show you how fast it'll drive in here, but I can give you an idea. Um, oh. So I'd be, I'll be able to show you when we go outside, okay? So the seat is elevated right now. You can see the color is purple. If this is, not the, it's just, if this is the chair you want, but this is not the color you want, let us know. We might be able to switch that color because these are just cover, cosmetic covers on here and on here and on, on here. Um, but we'd like to sell it with this color if we can. It has matching wheels also. So we have 14 inch solid wheels. They will not mark your floor. Caster wheels in the front, caster wheels in the back, also solid wheels. You have these anchor point. These are solid anchor point. They're tied to the frame. There's one here and one here. This is where you secure your chair for transporting this chair on your van or on your lift, okay? You have two on this side and you also have two more on the opposite side. Okay, so you have four of these anchor points. You have a motor for each wheel has an independent motor, okay? This chair right now weighs probably 440 pounds. That's a lot of weight. It's just a lot of metal, a lot of engineering. Great chair, 440 pound chair. So I'm not gonna be able to lift it or push it if I had an issue with the chair. But if you turn the power off, and the reason you want the power off in the chair, you want no resistance in the motor. So now you have the power off, just hit this yellow lever down and it tells you right here, push it down, what that does, it unlocks the wheel. You can unlock both sides and then you can roll the chair around, okay? When you're done rolling it, put it back in gear. You can see you're back in gear. Then turn your power back on and you're ready to go again. Now, you can see the armature for the seat lift, how well constructed this is. This is a uh, uh, X-frame seat lift. You can see the motor right here for the actuator. The motor's right here, making the seat go up. Um, I wanna show you the suspension on this chair. Look at the front of that chair. Look at that large suspension on both sides. There's two large shocks there. And if you look back here, you have the same suspension in the back. And these are independent fork. If I raise this one here, the other one stays on the ground. Independent suspension back there. These are just I just don't know how much better they can make these chairs. Five years ago, they started improving these chairs and now they're just so good now. Um, so I'm gonna bring the seat back down. While the seat is going down, let's talk about the swing away joystick. So this enables you to get a lot closer to a dining table without having to raise the arm up, okay? This chair is set up for right hand control. So if you're left-handed, we can switch everything to the left side and the joystick will flip to the left side. We can switch everything to the left side. The next feature I'm gonna show is called the electric tilt. The electric tilt is when the bottom, the base right here goes back right here. So when the base goes back, it takes the legs and it takes the back. And one more thing about these buttons right here, there's a one second delay. So if you push the button, it doesn't go back, just hold on, is a one second delay. This is your electric tilt. And the next thing I'm gonna show is called the electric legs. So these buttons, by the way, they're, if you touch them once, they go up. If you touch them again, they go down. So you gotta do it, they're, they're touch buttons. So you'll see when you get the chair. So if you needed some real good circulation, this with your legs would be pretty high up in the air right there, but you don't have to be quite this tilted back 
with your legs up to get good circulation. You could be halfway tilted, right about here, and you can see you still have your legs higher than your body. And these foot plates are adjustable, so if you're five feet tall, six foot two, we can adjust these legs over there, okay? So I'm gonna bring the tilt back down. And now the last function is called the electric recline. The electric recline is when the back goes back by itself. Whoop, do it again. Now watch the back go back. That's called the electric recline. So it's pretty much a full recline as you can see, okay? So I'm gonna bring the recline back up, I'm gonna bring the legs back down at the same time. So I'm doing two buttons at once, but if you wanna, but if you wanna do two functions at once, you can do it through the joystick. When you're outside though, leave your legs out. Let me show you right about, leave them out like that so you have a little more clearance. So I brought the seat too fast, too much forward, okay. So let's look at the chair now. So the seat on this chair is 21 inches by 20 deep. So it's a large seat. This is a Rojo cushion. This is the most expensive cushion you can get. It has a valve right here that you open up and you can pump air with a little plastic pump in here and it adjusts the pressure that you're This is really one of the most expensive cushion you can get. It does have a safety belt. The arms flip up so some of you transfer from the side so both arms flip up like this, okay? Now, if this seat is too big for you, and that's the chair you want, you like this chair, all these chairs, we can customize the seating system. We have all the cushions, the backs, we can make them larger, smaller, whatever size you need it, we can extend the legs, make the seat whatever size to, to fit your needs. So just let us know when, you, when, you, when you're looking at a chair, okay? This chair also has lights. If you see right here, there's a button, if I tap it, you can see now there's headlights. You can see the headlights right here, and you can see the tail lights back there, right here. So if you're in your house, you'll be able to light up your hallway. I'm not sure you'll be able to go on the highway with it, but... All right, so let's turn the lights off. The next thing I'm going to show you is uh, if you turn this chair in a circle in your house, Bring your legs in. So if you bring the legs in, watch, all the way in, your turning radius in your house will be a lot better. So I'm bringing the legs all the way in so you can see. All right, so now if you're in your house, look, look at that. This chair will turn in that circle right there, the length of the chair, pretty much. So, you know, you can see the length of the chair. It'll turn like this either way, either side, on its own length. When you exit the chair, you'll be able to flip up the foot plate and walk right out. Or if you do from the side, you can do it from the side, okay? So in the house, you'd want to keep your feet all the way in so you have more, a better, a shorter turning radius. Now, when you charge this chair, you'll take your quantum charger right here that comes with it. And you'll plug it right below the joystick and as soon as the light turns from orange to green, it's fully charged. There's two batteries in here, two batteries in these quantum chairs. They come out from the front, so you'd have to have the seat tilted or elevated so you can get to the front, the front cover. And then they, both batteries come out from the front, two batteries. They're supposed to give you about 15 miles on a battery charge. Folks, that 15 miles could be less or more. It all depends if you're going uphill, you're outside in the grass, how fast you're going, how many of the functions you use. So it all depends, this varies for everybody, okay? But let's recap. We've got here, we have here a Quantum Edge 3 power chair, the latest in technology. With three miles, it has the 12 inch seat lift, the electric tilt, the electric recline, the electric feet. It has the swing away joystick. It has the flip up arm, the air cushion, the safety belt, the light kit, the lighting kit from the factory, the adjustable headrest, the suspension we talked about earlier. This is just a nice power chair with three miles.
This is a Quantum Edge 3 power chair. Now this one I'm getting 6.2 miles an hour top speed. 6.2 miles an hour. And when you let go it stops automatically. Very easy to drive. Suspension is out of this world. No problem in the grass. My grass is pretty nice though. Um, so I'm going I'm to elevate the seat right now. So the seat's going up. And I want to show you how fast this drive, this chair drive with the seat elevated. So this is the Quantum Edge 3. It has the electric seat lift, the tilt, the recline, the electric legs, the swing away joystick, the air cushion. And the seat is almost all the way up. There we go. So we'll see how fast this one goes with the seat elevated. So this one goes all the way up to 4 miles an hour with the seat elevated. So if you're going to drive with the seat elevated, just make sure you're on a flat surface. This is not for the backyard with the seat elevated. These are nice chairs. You do have to take care of them and they'll last you a long time. So this chair, as I said, is practically new. Another beauty, ready to go. Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We're co-owners of Mark's Mobility. I started this company in 1995. We sell many products, not just what you see in this video. If you have any questions or concerns, please call us at the number below at 800-677-6293. Thank you and have a wonderful day.